These are some game ideas for boys and girls, some recreational ideas to do at home, music and dance. You can use different rhythm and styles. It can be slow music or fast music with percussion, music the parents like. It's important to move and dance with them. It's key that the parents use their bodies in the movements because children will imitate them. You can try it on different levels. You can dance on the floor by crawling or sliding. You can dance standing up. You can do the statue's dance where every statue is different. For example, a bug, a giraffe, a lion. It's important to change roles so that kids can say what statue they want to be. You can dance with objects. You can cut two pieces of toilet paper and use them as ribbons while dancing. A more elaborate option is a stick with colorful ribbons. You can also put some bells in it to make noise and that way you can have fun with a different type of ribbons. Another good activity is experiments. There's a certain age where children love doing experiments. You can make a magic potion by mixing different elements. Paint, water, glitter, paper, sequins, beads, anything you can imagine. You can make the game richer by adding a context. For example, you can create a story. We're scientists and we must make a potion to destroy a meteor that is approaching our planet. Or, we're wizards, and we want to make a magic potion to transform a lettuce into a frog. You can also invent words for that potion or spell. Another fun activity are circuits. You can make them with objects from your home. Depending on each kid, you can modify the complexity of the circuit. You can make rows with sneakers, use broomsticks, pillows, chairs, buckets, ropes, anything you can imagine. It's better if you add a context, not just the movement. We're going through this circuit because we're training to be superheroes. Or we have to go through the jungle with different challenges and traps. Another activity you can do with children is creating stories. You can create stories with different prompts. Choose three images and create a story that includes those elements. For example, elephant, bucket, and tree. You can create a story related to a place, a character, or an action. The child must choose. Then, the child and the adult will create the story. For example, you can draw or download an image of the place where you want the story to happen. It could be a beach, a jungle, a city. And then, you can use a dog, a superhero, a witch, or an old man, as a character. For actions, you can choose play, cook, camping, or whatever comes to mind. It would be good, that there were not too many options available, just between three or four, for each category. It could get complicated, for a small child, to choose between too many options. Another activity is giving new uses to regular objects. You can grab a bed sheet and shake it at different speeds. Make your favorite doll jump without letting it drop. Take the doll for a walk around the house. You can also use Tupperware, pans, and plastic cups as percussion instruments. Each will make a different sound. You can create rhythms and make your child imitate them. You can also exchange roles. You can put on a song to follow along with a pan. Pretend to be drummers. You can also build different types of buildings, towers, or castles. When doing any of these activities, it's important to adapt the proposals to what provokes the most interest in each child. Switch roles so that the child can have a more active role and then a passive role. Adapt the difficulty of the proposals according to the child's age. Always find some time, 15 or 30 minutes, to completely dedicate to games and playing. Get involved and play with your body. Let's remember why these activities are good for children. They create quality time moments between parents and children. Creativity. Confidence in themselves. Psychomotor development. Rhythm and musicality. 
Development of Symbolic Play The Expression of Ideas and Emotions Through Words and Body Remember, to always find moments, short but quality moments, to spend with your children. Funny.